Hey there guys and welcome back to a video on Space Engineers, but this is not going to be a building economy episode. The, you're probably wondering what the hell I'm doing because of what the hell is in front of me. Well, today I hoping, I'm hoping I'm going to be doing a service to the community and helping understand, or helping people understand and explaining triangles. The point of triangles. So if you go on info, uh, it would be up here if I had, uh, if I was on a ship. So. Obviously, for the exploration mode, uh, the developers were asking for some ships to be, um, or some ships, some stations to be uploaded for possibility to be a part of, like, the exploration thing, as in you come across it randomly. But you had, on the second time they asked, they had some specifications that you wanted to do, and that it had to be within a certain amount of triangles. So if I get into this first thing that I have here, this first little chair go on to info if it will just stop doing things like that and you will see down here that is what they're looking for triangles there so this chair here has exactly 617 triangles so if I then come out of that so another thing I need I should point out straight away is that it is done by like a face well I'll come back to that actually but yeah so this chair is worth 617 triangles and I was actually going to write all this down before I actually went through all this so it'll be a little bit easier but I decided I was going to record because I forgot about doing that but never mind so if I then cut jump into this and do info here you'll see that this has 665 triangles which if you mine as the chair which is 617 that makes it about 48 I think yes 48 triangles so this is just the plain old simple uh, light armor block and I will say exactly this now that the uh, heavy armor and the light armor are exactly the same amount of triangles so all of this variant like for all these bits that have the armor block on it it's exactly the same for all designs, well, I would assume all. I didn't check necessarily the, or for me, I did check this block specifically, and it's the same. So, yeah. So, if I then jump into this, do that, go info, 649 minus 617 makes it only like 22 or 32. So, that's only 32 triangles for that block. And that's only something small. I do have it written down somewhere. I think I do have some of these bits written down. So I'm not doing all of this. Uh, it's not in that one. It's probably in the one behind me. Bear with. It's in the one with the shopping list on it. Useful. Um, what page? On the other back page. Is it this one? Oh my god, that's a lot of things though. Maybe it's not here. Maybe I'm in the right one. Um, um, interesting. Um, no, it's not that one. Maybe it is this one. Maybe I'm looking in the wrong spot. I am looking in the wrong spot. Right, I found it. Right, I've got the basic information that I needed to know right now. So this is the triangle, so to say. Uh, I've, I said that as the slant. This is the triangle, so I went into it. It has 32, as I thought. And this block, which is the cropped one, that one has 40. So that one only has 40 triangles. It's obviously managing off. Uh, I'll, I will show you quickly. Yeah, minus the 617 makes 40. Right, and here comes the interesting part. And if you've watched my previous video, you'll probably already know this, but this is an interior wall. I was wanting to build with this, and I, and I was thinking, yeah, it should be fine. Go on the info, 3,241. What? So, minus off the actual control point, the cockpit that I'm in, it's... 2,624 per block. So that is why I said not to build and why I suggest if you want to try and keep within a triangle count for a ship that, or a station that you want to upload, avoid the interior wall. Most... Because, uh, uh, yeah, that's how it is. Um, I haven't actually quite set up uh, something else I wanted to do. Uh, if I quickly just get it up uh, let's build along quickly here like so 
like so, take away that one, put on a cockpit quickly, and then just get rid of that. Right, so as you'll see, I've put two blocks next to each other now. So if I jump into there, this should be the same as what the first one was, which I don't think I have currently written down, do I? Um... 665, yeah, 665, which is a cockpit and one single block. If you were to add 48 to that, you would think it would be uh, 700 and something. So it, would be, it would be 707, but it only comes up as 697, which is to the conclusion, of my conclusion, that it is done by side of each block. Uh, so 48 divided by 8 sides is 6. So if you minus off two sixes, because you've minus off two sides, that is probably where you'll come. So if I'm put on two sixes, there will be 6. 703, 709, which would be uh, roughly about right. Not perfect, but that would be pretty much, yeah. You each It is done by each side, so if I clear out that. So each side of the normal block is roughly uh, each plane, like four square bit if there wasn't two, uh, is done by, is counted. So it's six, 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 six. So that's how that works. The next thing is, uh, I don't know which one's which. Uh, let me get one out. You are the solid block, right. So let's do that one first. Over here, I have a hollowed out I'll just take the middle out. Nope, that's placing it. Take that out. You'll see there is a hollow block there. There is a missing one in the middle. If I place that back on there, and you've already seen that it's uh, solid on the other side. If we go on the info, this says 1097. And then I'll go over to this one over here, which is the solid one, which I was in a discussion on a post of some sort. I don't know where it was. I'll try and put a link to it down on in the description because I have got it saved as a favorite page so I at least know where it is uh, it was a post for like a few months ago or several months ago I only had like three comments on it and I then said my ideas on it and someone said more blocks equals more triangles which in a way yes but in this case it is less triangles this solid block is less triangles than the hollow one because even though what I'm guessing is even though well it, it I'm guessing it doesn't count the planes that are together because they don't need to be like what's the word I'm trying to look for here they don't need to be generated so to say that's, I think that's close enough where I can think of to say so it doesn't count planes that are next to each other but it will count if it's hollow so Someone in the conversation was saying your best bet is to build a hollow ship. I think that is wrong. My best advice would be to build a solid block ship. Cause I think it was something along the lines he likes to build several layers of armour. Is that going to cause problems? It won't necessarily cause more problems. A solid block like this one equals less triangles. It does equal more mass, which makes it harder for it to necessarily move, which is, I think is what my problem was with infin infinity. Uh, but yeah, so this is another solid block, even bigger. I haven't done this one before. I've only done literally those first front ones. So this is 1385. And over on the hollow one. If I can get down. I really ought to have set a like, gra gen gra yeah, gravity generator up. <laughs> To make it a bit easier, but this is one five seven seven, which is more, and this is hollow. So I'll, I'll completely show you that again. I'll get number one out. I'll get that out, and I'll show you that this is a completely hollow block. See, completely hollow, and that has more triangles than this solid one, which isn't going to work if I do it like that. Completely solid. Cannot get through if I go zero. You can see solid. So, again, my advice, build them solid. as, as Or fill in empty spaces. So if there is, like, say, a space of this kind of size, fill it in. If it's a bit bigger, it may not be as advised for, like, mass 
but I, I'm not thinking of mass right now. I'm thinking of triangles. That is what I'm trying to discuss on. Uh, I don't know whether I should go through all of these on video. I think I'll just um, work it out off screen and put all the information that I find down in the description below. Um, I can't say necessarily on some of these things accurately, I don't think, because um, certain blocks have different... They're not like plain and simple like the normal block there. It's just... Um, so it depends on where a block would appear on this, I think, probably as to what actually needs to be generated and what would count. So so it's not going to be even it's not going to be even on the sides per like triangle that's what i should be saying so it also it would all depend on how i've placed it as to how accurate and how good i am making my judgment on these i have made them as best as possible to what you would place it as for certain things like connectors and um droppers or whichever one connectors hoppers i'm thinking bloody minecraft right now Connect um, droppers hoppers connectors and whatever that one is collector that's what it is so yeah um i think these are probably the best ones all the important ones anyway at least like the and this is obviously for the large ship small ship would be different I'm not sure if i can be asked to go through all that but if i am requested to i will make a point of going through all the small ship ones but it will be more difficult because they will be flying about everywhere but yeah request it and i will probably do it but I'm hoping these are more important ones. Uh, the large cargo container, the small cargo container, the large thruster, and the small the, the battery, the uh, both generator things, the gravity, the thingamajiggy, the, all the connection pipes, the refineries, and the solar panel and stuff. I hope that that's probably going to be the more important things and more necessary. I've got the buttons down there, which isn't necessarily, but hey ho. So. Yeah, I hope this video has been actually informative, because I don't normally do informative videos, and helpful to you. If it has, please, please leave it a like. This is the one video I'm actually going to really ask. If it has definitely helped you, please leave it a like and let me know, because I feel like I'm doing a good thing for once. <laughs> Not just being, oh, let's do this, let's do that. I'm actually trying to do something to help people. So, yeah. Like I said, leave a like, uh, comment below any questions you might have that I can probably try and work out, or you can probably try and work it out yourself with how I've done it, you can see how I've done it. Um, and yeah, what was the other thing? Share with your friends, because obviously if the, your friends are having problems with it, let them know, or just generally share. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye for now, and I haven't been fucking recording. I'm just going to be a bit more... I don't know what I'm going to fucking do for that, but still. Okay, right. Fuck it.